Warn us? About what? It came over us last night. At first, it was just a slight tremor, but then it became a violent earthquake. It could have reduced a whole mountain range to rubble. Hordes of terrible creatures suddenly emerged from the depths of the earth and destroyed whole sections of Steamer Town. Five of us were actually killed. We should never have let Furnace Child into our house. Come on, let's throw him out now. What? Well, yes, that could be a cause. Uh, perhaps it's the wrath of the gods, or perhaps it is the powers of the underworld wanting to destroy us. Who knows? This uh, doesn't sound too good for us. Well then, Melvin, I think it's finally time for you to leave us. But I haven't done anything wrong. Why me? I... I've never been to Steamer Town. Yeah. Shut your mouth, you little steamer. We'd be better off without you anyhow. Now stop exaggerating. What am I actually accused of? I'm innocent. Yeah. What do you all want from him? He's innocent. You can't just throw him out. Be quiet, Carissa. If we say he's guilty, then... Uh-oh. Lynch. Please, everyone, calm down and just think for a moment what you're asking. Phew. Saved by the council. With the huge crystal around his neck. Only the High Council of the city is authorized to issue judgments. We won't be able to pass judgment on this matter before morning, but it will at least be a just one. Therefore, young Melvin, you should go to your uncle's house and stay there until then. Well, uh, I'll show the rest of the cutscene in the next video. Until then, everyone, and have a nice day.